When I owned WNOL Channel 38, the TV station on there, every restaurant I went to, they ordered from Leah Chase, Dukey Chase restaurant first, because they knew I wouldn't eat anything but hers. And then she taught me how to make it. And I put a, a layer of white rice, sauteed uh, sauce shell crab on that, and put the gumbo on top of that. She taught me that. <laughs> she sent me the natural ingredients from the Gulf of Mexico. One of the greatest ladies I've ever known. Forget just the uh, cuisine. You know, she was an activist, big activist. So something. Please do not forget, subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell to be notified when we upload next. Quincy Jones was one of the most talented and influential figures in music history. His career spanned over seven decades, touching nearly every corner of the music world and beyond. Known for his ability to blend different styles and genres, Quincy Jones was much more than a producer or musician, he was a true cultural icon whose impact reached far beyond the notes he played or the records he produced. Early Life and Humble Beginnings Quincy Delight Jones Jr. was born on March 14, 1933, in Chicago, Illinois. His childhood was not easy. Growing up during the Great Depression, Quincy faced many challenges. His family struggled to make ends meet, and his mother was often ill. But from a young age, Quincy found solace in music. He discovered that music could lift his spirits, giving him a sense of peace and purpose. In his early teens, Quincy moved to Seattle, where he joined the school band and learned to play the trumpet. His natural talent quickly became evident. By the time he was 14, Quincy was already dreaming of a life dedicated to music. His passion and determination were so strong that he would practice for hours each day, honing his skills and learning everything he could about music. First Steps in the Music Industry Quincy's dedication to music led him to Berklee College of Music in Boston, where he studied for a brief time before he was offered the chance to tour with Lionel Hampton, a jazz band leader. Touring with Hampton's band was Quincy's first big break, allowing him to immerse himself in the world of professional music. Quincy learned quickly from other talented musicians, discovering new styles and techniques that would shape his unique approach. He began to experiment with arranging music, putting his spin on traditional jazz songs. By the early 1950s, Quincy was becoming known as a gifted arranger, and he caught the attention of many musicians in the jazz world. A pioneer of jazz and beyond. Quincy's skill as a musician and arranger grew as he began working with some of the greatest jazz artists of the time. He collaborated with legends like Dizzy Gillespie, Ray Charles, and Duke Ellington. His ability to bring fresh ideas into jazz, mixing traditional elements with innovative sounds, made Quincy a rising star. By the 1960s, Quincy's reputation as a producer and arranger was firmly established. He was one of the first African-American musicians to break into the world of film and television music, an industry that was often closed to people of color. Quincy scored his first major film, The Pawnbroker, in 1964, which led to more opportunities. Over the years, he would work on the music for films like In the Heat of the Night and The Italian Job, as well as classic television shows. Breaking Barriers with Michael Jackson Quincy Jones may be best known for his work with Michael Jackson. In the late 1970s, Quincy was asked to produce Michael's album, Off the Wall. Quincy brought his experience, skill, and unique vision to the project, and the album was a massive success, with hit songs like, Don't Stop, Till You Get Enough, and Rock With You. The album sold millions of copies and marked the beginning of a legendary partnership. Following the success of Off the Wall, Quincy and Michael teamed up again to create Thriller. Released in 1982, Thriller would become the best-selling album of all time, with iconic tracks like, Beat It, Billie Jean, and Thriller. Quincy's innovative production style helped shape the sound of the album, blending pop, rock, and funk in a way that had never been done before. But Thriller was more than just an album, it was a cultural phenomenon. Quincy and Michael's collaboration changed the music industry, 
and the album's success opened doors for artists of color around the world. Quincy's work on Thriller cemented his place as one of the most influential producers in music history. Champion for Social Justice Beyond music, Quincy was a powerful voice for social justice. He believed deeply in the power of music to bring people together and to create positive change. Throughout his life, he used his platform to speak out against racism, inequality, and violence. He worked with artists and organizations dedicated to social causes, and he was not afraid to challenge the status quo. In 1985, Quincy co-produced We Are The World, a charity single featuring dozens of famous artists. The song was written by Michael Jackson and Lionel Richie, and all proceeds went to help those suffering from hunger in Africa. We Are The World became one of the best-selling singles of all time and raised millions of dollars for charity. Quincy's leadership in this project showed his commitment to using music as a force for good. Mentorship and Legacy Quincy's impact on music extended beyond his own projects. He was a mentor to many young artists, always willing to share his knowledge and experience. From jazz musicians to pop stars, countless artists have credited Quincy with helping them find their voice and navigate the music industry. His passion for nurturing talent was evident in the way he encouraged others to push boundaries and strive for excellence. He founded several programs and institutions dedicated to promoting music education and supporting young artists. Through his work, Quincy inspired generations of musicians, showing them that hard work, dedication, and creativity could lead to great success. His legacy is not only in the music he created but also in the lives he touched and the artists he inspired. A Lasting Impact on Culture Quincy Jones was more than just a musician. His influence extended into every part of popular culture. He helped shape the sound of jazz, pop, and hip-hop, and his work in film and television changed the way people thought about music in visual media. He was a symbol of excellence and innovation, always willing to take risks and try new things. In his later years, Quincy continued to be a respected figure in the entertainment industry. He received countless awards and honors for his contributions, including Grammy Awards, an honorary Oscar, and even a Grammy Legend Award. But for Quincy, the real reward was in the music itself and the joy it brought to people around the world. Remembering Quincy Jones, a legacy of inspiration. As we remember Quincy Jones, we remember a life dedicated to music, to breaking down barriers, and to inspiring others. His journey was not always easy, but his passion and determination kept him moving forward. Quincy's story is one of resilience, creativity, and hope. He believed in the power of music to change lives, and he used his talent to make a difference in the world. Quincy's legacy lives on in every song he produced, every artist he mentored, and every fan who was touched by his music. His work will continue to inspire future generations, reminding us that greatness comes from following one's passion and never giving up on one's dreams. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to daily updates and never miss a video.